Folks, welcome back to Drone Bee Farm and Homestead. So they say the best camera that you can have is the one that you have with you at the time. So I have my phone here. I'm going to shoot a quick video. I want to show you. Uh, so I fed a couple days ago, and I just came down here to pick up my honey supers that I would pulled off to, to get them stored away. And I noticed uh, one of the hives that I fed, number 12, looked like it was getting robbed. Uh, so it's not that strong of a hive and there's a lot of bees out front. So uh, let me show you uh, what I did. So here it is right here. And I put on one of those beast blockers that I got from Saracel that I had on my giveaway. A couple folks from Canada said uh, they prefer an Amazon card to uh, having that. So it was a lot cheaper for me to give them an Amazon card and to ship this thing to them. So I've got a couple of them. And uh, so this is called the Beast Blocker. And I got a lock down right now. So uh, these two levers lift up. So I'm assuming those bees coming out of there are robbers. So uh, if you remember right, I put uh, see there's eight frames in here now and there were six and that whole thing is just full of bees there's still quite a bit of uh, sugar water in the frame feeder so they had not been getting robbed too long and another thing I did I pulled the inner or the outside cover back so that inner cover hole is blocked off you see that bee right there trying to get in up there so that's blocked off now they can't get in through there so I'd say that's doing a pretty good job. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, keep it locked down till dusk. And uh, at dusk, I'll come out here and I'll open that up. So all those robber bees will fly out at that point and not come back and then I'll leave it open just a little bit. So I got part of the greeting party following me, getting head butted. So yeah, uh, that's the Beast Buster entrance reducer uh, that stops robbing, and it's also a transportation uh, device. You can lock down your hive if you want to transport it, and uh, it, you can see the uh, screw holes in there. I had it screwed in, which the uh, top screw holes and the bottom ones, for that matter, didn't quite line up. So they're on the bottom ones, they're a little bit low and they're close to the entrance. They need to be about a quarter inch higher. And the top ones, if you're running a slatted rack like I was, the, the screw almost lines up perfect with that, the crack on the uh, slatted rack. So that's some things that I would suggest they change. But uh, looks like it's working pretty good. So uh, hopefully that stops that robbing frenzy and uh, the little Hive 12 will survive. So that's it. Just a quick video. Hope you enjoyed it. Give me a thumbs up and subscribe on your way out if you would, please. Catch you on the next beekeeping video. Take care.